In the meantime, two sections of a popular county road in Dickinson County will be repaved. Now, the Dickinson County Road Commission will use recycled glass and tires from across the UP. TV6's Clint McLeod shares how the sustainable efforts will benefit the roads. Some of County Road 577 in Dickinson County will soon be repaved. This September, two sections south of Vulcan going towards the Menominee County line will be redone. The Dickinson County Road Commission will use different materials to pave the roads compared to standard asphalt. It's a research project looking at the use of scrap tire rubber in um, asphalt pavements and the other one's also using uh, recycled glass. The Road Commission will use more than 12,000 recycled tires and more than 1 million glass bottles from the Marquette County Solid Waste Management Authority in its asphalt. Malberg and the Road Commission have worked with researchers at Michigan Tech University to bring the project to life. The, the rubber from tires actually are really good the materials to work with asphalt. They basically like each other kind of, you know, because they are both are from a, uh, you know, petroleum oil. The Road Commission first used recycled material when it repaves County Road 607 in 2018. Malberg says using these rubber tire chips and creating asphalt can help increase the flexibility of the road during cold months. The Road Commission engineer says the two projects will cost about $2 million, but more than $800,000 in grant money from Michigan Tech and the Department of Environment, Great Lakes, and Energy will cover about half of it. Malberg says using recycled material and asphalt is the way of the future. Landfills can't take stuff forever. There's a lot of scrap tires out there. Bottles are stacking up. The two projects will begin after Labor Day and should be completed by mid-October. Malberg says County Road 577 is the fourth busiest road in the county and one of the major logging truck routes. Clint McLeod, TV6 News, Vulcan.